BJP Shivsena Alliance seems to be in bit of a danger now with BJP announcing that Maharashtra candidates could be declared before the announcement of seat sharing formula. In 2009 assembly elections, Shivsena fought 169 and BJP on 119 seats. Now this time, BJP wants 135 and roundabouts uh, that number for uh, the seat sharing formula with 18 seats to NDA allies from Shiv Sena quota. Now, Shiv Sena ready to give 18 seats to NDA allies, but not willing to give a single seat to BJP from the Shiv Sena quota. Aishwarya is joining us uh, for more. Aishwarya, there seems to be quite a bit of a squabble now between the BJP and the Shiv Sena, but the big question is, can they really afford to jeopardize the alliance and give that advantage to the opposition? Well, that's the point which you just mentioned, but this time around, BJP is making one thing very clear, that they are no more the younger brother. They need to be treated equally, as you just mentioned, that last time around in 2009 elections, uh, Shiv Sena 469, and then BJP was on 119, but this time around, BJP wants it very clear, 135, 135, 50, 50, and then 18 seats they want from the Shiv Sena quota to be given to the ND Alliance partners. But the Shiv Sena, according to sources, is very clear. They say that they can give... Uh, last time they uh, they uh, they gave 119. This time they can give not more than five to more six more seats to the BJP. Yes, they are ready to give 18 seats to the uh, to the ND Alliance partners, which include the RPI, SSS, RSP, JSP. But at the end of the day, the deadlock continues because BJP says nothing going. They cannot be treated as the younger brother. They 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 are in power in the center, and then the Modi wave. If they feel that it is going to be uh, reverberated in the is, uh, in these assembly polls as well. But they right. want 135, 135, but Shiv Sena at this point of time not ready to give anything more than 125.